first year, so I must have been about 11 or 12, I got this weird obsession with hiding notes and things in library books. I would just open a random page of any old book, and this was how I found out about Sally Ride. I don't think I'd seen a picture of a female astronaut before. There was a photo of her in those like blue NASA overalls with a little walkie-talkie thing in her ear. She had this massive 80s dark curly hair all floating about in the weightlessness. I became completely obsessed with her. I put my obsession down to seeing a woman in a job like that. It was really inspirational, and it was definitely partly that, but in retrospect, I think it was more likely my not yet known baby queer gaydar was being set off. <laughs> my intense obsession for Sally Ride kind of burnt out a bit as I got older, thank God. And when I was with my girlfriend years later, by that point as a super queer teenager, I remembered her and was like, uh, she is so gay, I have to search this. Although it didn't say anywhere that she was, in fact, she'd married a fellow astronaut, Steve Hawley, which broke my heart a little bit. But then it said they were divorced, so it gave me hope again. <laughs> in 2012, Sally Ride died of pancreatic cancer. I remember hearing it on the radio in my car. She came out in death, though. In her obituary, she refers to Tam O'Shaughnessy as her partner of 27 years. I was like, wait, what? This news made, like, time concertina in my mind, and I had this involuntary image in my head of going back and telling my baby self in the library. The couple set up Sally Ride Science, which is an institution concerned with inspiring young people to get into sciences, especially young girls. As the first American female astronaut in space, I guess she knew how important it was for young people to have pioneers, like, like role models to look up to, to help them realise their own potential. And, you know, she said, you can't be what you can't see. And now, as the only known LGBT astronaut, She's done this for the queer community too.